I think the most important bit is probably the business uh, side. And there, it's the agent's job to sell the writer's work to publishers and to ensure that the rights of the, uh, of the author are exploited in the most effective way. So that might be to sell all the rights via one publisher. It might be to sell uh, translation or American rights from the agency direct to publishers overseas. Um, there's also an editorial role to make sure that the book uh, leaves the agent in the most, uh, the, the best way ready for publication by the, by the publishing house. And more and more now, I think, um, the editorial role is important within an agency. Uh, there's also perhaps a, what could be described as a nurturing role, which is to work closely um, with the writer throughout their career. So the, the publishing house will be involved with the writer over publication of their book, whereas the agent will be involved with them right through the, the writing of it, the publishing of it, and the aftermath. So it's a constant role in that respect, riding the ups and downs of the, of the writer's um, uh, year. So to immerse um, yourself in books, so perhaps work in a bookshop, um, perhaps work in a publishing company, just surround yourself um, in books and see why you think they're working. I, th I think the relationship between an author and an agent is probably one of the most stable relationships um, in the author's life because the editor in a publishing house may well change. The, a children's writer will need lots of different editors and yet the constant is the agent. And so the relationship between the author and the agent is very important on both sides to enable a successful career for the writer.